This is News in Brief from Al24 News. The Algerian Foreign Minister Ahmed Attaf will address today the United Nations General Assembly, where he will present Algeria's stance towards several issues, including the Middle East and Western Sahara. In an updated toll, the Lebanese Health Ministry announced the martyrdom of over 45 citizens, in addition to 70 others injured in the city of Saida, southern Lebanon, following a heavy surge of Zionist airstrikes on the region. The aggression has also resulted in waves of internal and external mass displacement and according to the UNHCR, 100,000 of Syrians and Lebanese have crossed the borders into Syria, in bid to escape the shelling. The longtime leader of France's far-right National Rally Party, Marine Le Pen, went on trial in Paris court on Monday alongside 26 others over accusations of embezzling European Union funds through using money destined for EU parliamentary work to pay staff who were working for the party, formerly called the National Front. The fake jobs inquiry began in 2015, with prosecutors saying that since 2004, National Front Euro deputies, including Le Pen, took part in the fake job schemes, and by far, the European Parliament has estimated the loss at around 7 million euros. The far-right Freedom Party was declared winner on Sunday evening, according to the preliminary results of Austria's parliamentary elections, a victory that was hailed by hard-right parties across Europe. Nevertheless, other party leaders united in rejecting to form a coalition with Kikul, and therefore, if he fails to secure an alliance, the chance would go to another coalition of more moderate parties. This was today's News in Brief from Earl24 News.